What is going on, my YouTube friends, all my Patreon friends? How are we all doing today? I got a special request from them, the band themselves. This came from, uh, I should have grabbed the email address or at least the name off the email address. The band is Zonies, Zonis, Zonies, an after party live studio performance of the song Too Much. They reached out and they asked me to review their song. And of course, man, of course, I love helping out uh, indie bands, I assume. Let me check this out. Let me see what the description box says. Uh, is a married musical duo. Oh, from Victoria, some Canadians. What's up? What's up from your uh, chilly, chilly neighbors in Southern Alberta? We got our snow this week, but I heard y'all are getting rain tonight. Uh, looks indie, bro. Looks indie. I love it. I love it. I'm looking forward to this. Um, comments look like it's going to be soulful, dance worthy, maybe. Looking forward to it, man. Thanks for reaching out. I love trying to support uh, and helping out bands where I can. Um, I'm sure if you're reaching out to me that you, you know that uh, I have like a background as a live technician. I've been doing some producing and uh, studio mixing for the, more so for the last couple of years. But I have been in the industry for like 17 years, man. So that's usually where I go. I'm not really a top-down listener when it comes to music. Um, I don't really know how to describe how I listen to music, but uh, we'll find words for it one day. But I really appreciate this. I really appreciate you coming and finding me. I'm going to have the link to this video in the description box, y'all. If y'all like this, if y'all this please show some support to the original artist uh i think we could probably help them get over a thousand subscribers y'all they're pretty close they're pretty close how many we got it doesn't say it doesn't say 976 something like that so i'm looking forward to i'm looking forward to checking this out let me pull this video up let me stop rambling and uh let's do this let's do this You know it's going to be good just based on Buddy's shirt. Like, come on now. Let's hear that again. Come on now. Ah, look at this suit. Y'all, the Paisley in the suit, too? Come on now. Come on now. This is about to be groovy. This is about to be groovy. We've got left-handed bass. Mandolin leading the way. Let's go. I am proud that I don't lie. I speak my mind and let my emotions cry. And my anger has a voice. My presence is my choice. Clean, y'all. Clean, y'all. I'm enjoying this. I'm enjoying this. I love the dynamics and the vocal. Like, so often, I'm going to, like, kind of blanket statement here. A lot of singers, especially in a live environment, will kind of go, like, up and then stay up, right? But she's given us, like, a lot of this, like, growing and developing and ebb and flows in the vocal. And it's really nice, y'all. SM58s don't exactly give a lot of love <laughs> when it comes to their, their industry standards for a reason like they're indestructible but they're not like the most forgiving microphone to sing into let's say so like that's all that's all her performance y'all like and i i think it adds to the song it's like it's building me up and it's sucking me in based on like how she goes up and it brings it back down um <clears throat> i'm assuming this is hubby really nice gibson guitar man i love these gibsons uh just a beautiful guitar beautiful strumming on that like i always say when you when you imagine a guitar depending on your background when you imagine a guitar you imagine a martin when you like picture the sound of an acoustic guitar in your head but when you find a guitar that you're happy with it's probably a gibson <laughs> it's just the way it is y'all i got a gibson tattoo like i'm a i'm a sucker for him but i love this y'all 
I love this. Everyone's got in ears. Um, I'm assuming it must be like a pretty solid mix. It looks like a sweet room we're in, and that's obviously going to help when it comes to controlling dynamics and stuff like that. But I've I've been in some situations with some really talented monitor technicians, and I've seen a lot of really talented singers not sing with this much dynamics. So I am vibing with it. I'm here for. It. Nice. But I won't obey myself, myself. Oh, oh, oh. Mm. I won't betray. I am woman. Hear me roar. I won't be silent anymore. Laugh too loud. I say too much. Can't keep my inside voice in. It always fits. that dynamic see that dynamic drop off like i think we're getting to a chorus here or maybe a pre-chorus but like again she brought it way down like it's just it's just pulling me closer to the piece right um buddy on the strap buddy on the strap it's kind of noodling away but staying out of the way and that's important too right like awareness situational awareness in your band especially in a live situation y'all like come on now y'all are killing it i love the fits man i can't get over the fits <laughs> Sex. That was groovy, man, because like we're we're at a slow enough BPM for like sixteenth notes to be fine for the for the uh, for the lead section, because like it's always a battle between like sixteenth or thirty second notes or triplets, right? But having that section in the triplets almost made it feel like it drug, like it was dragging a little bit, but it made it like way groovier. It's like just fast enough to get away with that like this this not half time, but like the quarter note. I don't know how would you say that. Um, cause you could do triplets quicker, but he was doing like the, the cut in half version of that. I don't know how else to describe it. <laughs> and it's like just enough to feel like moody. Like it's got energy. It's got some stank on it. You know what I mean? Great lead, man. Great lead from the sax player. <laughs> Nice vibrato too. Real nice vibrato. Man, that was a killer, that was a killer set. Killer song. Shout out to Victoria, man. There must be something in the water in BC. There must be something in the water in BC. I vibed with this. I vibed with this a lot, y'all. I really dug it. I really like the control that they demonstrated, both in like restraint and in like showcasing a little bit too, right? Like sax player going off. Um, band felt like they were having fun. They were giving it their all, but like not getting in the way because the the melody of the vocal, the dynamic presence of the vocal told such a story on its own that you don't want to like walk on top of that right like you do want some noodly like guitar work you want some things to bring out that top section of the mix but you don't want to get in the way of the vocal that's already dancing on top of this like really 
kind of like fun space that the band's giving them, right? I thought they did a great job balancing that, y'all. I dug this one. I appreciate y'all coming and sending this to me, man. Please send me some more. Send me send me all your releases. Go for it. Have at it. I'm going to have the link to this video in the description box, y'all. Please show them some love. Uh, I got all my links in the description box, too, if y'all want to send any requests or anything or come join the Discord and hang out. And uh, catch you on the next one.